our nervousness mounts as we enter one of the two 120 passenger cabins, which will take us up to the top of Mount Harrison and the Ober Gatlingburg Amusement Park and Ski Complex. As we travel upwards, you will see the city of Gatlingburg slowly drop below us, along with as many hotels, restaurants, and shops. The city of Gatlingburg is built at the entranceway to the Great Smoky Mountain National Park, along with its 11 million tourists each year. As you can see below you, the trees are beginning to recover from the 2016 raging forest fire that swept through the Great Smoky Mountain National Park in the city of Gatlinburg. The fire burnt more than 10,000 acres. Overhead you will see three cables for each tram. The outer cables are for support, and the inner cable, called the hog cable, moves the trams. Wave to your sister tram going by. The terrain in this area of the Great Smoky Mountain National Park is so steep that many of the homes are built on stilts, with very little of the actual house touching the ground. There are six towers along the 2.1 mile area tramway, and it travels about 17 miles per hour. It will take about 10 minutes to reach the top. If you're lucky, you might glimpse at the 1974 Dollhouse, which is an exact replica of the 1974 Barbie Dream House, and it is for sale. The tram will drop you off in the indoor amusement park of Ober Gatlingburg. Here you'll find an ice skating rink, along with bumper cars, food services, and gift stores. Once outside, you will discover an alpine slide, a ski mountain coaster, chair swings, mini golf, along with a scenic chairlift to the top of Mount Harrison. Pedro, fresh from his recent mountain coaster ride at Goats on the Roof in Pigeon Forge, couldn't wait to try out Ober's mountain coaster. It took more than a little effort for us to convince Pedro that we didn't have the time for him to go fishing with his newfound friend. Well, our day adventure at Ober is coming to an end, and we are slowly making our way back down the mountain to the city of Gatlingburg. While at Ober, we enjoyed ourselves as we sped down the tracks of their mountain coaster, got lost finding the letters in their maze, and fed on pretzels as we watched the kids bounce off each other in their ice bumper cars. For anyone wanting to visit the top of Ober and doesn't want to go through the expense or the apprehension of traveling the tram system, you can take Ski Mountain Road, which is located at traffic light number 10 in the city of Gatlinburg. But be wary that it is a twisted, narrow, winding, two-mile road to the top. In the distance, you will always see the mountains covered in a blue haze. This led the Cherokee Indians to call the mountains Shakanahe, land of the blue smoke. Coming up on the left, you will see Obar's sister tram. Remember to wave to it as it goes by. Below you will see the Gatlingburg Bypass. For those heading into Cherokee to the casinos or hiking in the Great Smoky Mountains, this road, starting just outside Gatlinburg, will allow you to bypass city traffic. Below you will see another view of the damage caused by the Gatlingburg Fire of 2016.
Scattered among the hillside, you could still see the foundations of burnt out buildings never to be rebuilt. Hobear has its own parking lot located by taking the lower river road. The tram will begin slowing down and end with a small jar as we enter the tram station, ending our adventure for today. This is used for outdoor staycations. I hope you enjoyed our adventure together.